Microsoft Outlook has become the most sought-after application with professionals as well as organizations. All their everyday communication is dependent on this application. Hence, it is necessary to know everything about it. Hello friends. Welcome to today's video where we will be talking all about the cached exchange mode in Outlook. But before that, do subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. Let's get started. MS Outlook is truly a life-changing application for all professionals. It uses two modes to connect with the Exchange Server, Online Mode, and Cache Mode. The Cached Exchange Mode comes in handy in situations where the network connectivity is low or unavailable. The Cached Exchange Mode keeps the users connected to the Exchange data by saving a copy of their mailbox on the local system in the form of an OST file. The mails are constantly updated and work in synchronous with the cached file, as they get updated with the server continuously. Now, the big question arises: is, how to enable the cached exchange mode in MS Outlook? Don't worry, we will guide you through this entire process, launch MS Outlook, and click on the Files tab. Expand Account Settings and click on Account Settings. Choose the account and click on Change. Check against use cached exchange mode under offline settings. Now, close and restart the Outlook application. Though OST files facilitate offline working, problems arise when they become inaccessible. This can happen due to various hardware and software issues. It can happen with all Outlook and Exchange versions too. This issue cannot be resolved accurately by any manual methods and requires professional guidance throughout. The right solution is to convert the OST to PST file format by using the kernel for OST to PST software. The software aims at the retrieval of inaccessible emails, contacts, calendars, attachments, and other contents from corrupted or inaccessible OST files. It is designed to convert multiple OST files of even larger sizes into various file formats, like PST, MBOX, PDF, EML, etc. It can even export them to Exchange, Office 365, and other email servers. And no need to worry, it is well compatible with all Windows operating system versions. This process of converting OST to PST is quite simple with the kernel for OST to PST. We hope that you were able to understand cached exchange mode and its importance. It is useful for working under a low internet connection, as it maintains a local copy of the mailbox items, so do make sure to keep the cache mode is enabled in your Outlook email client. Thank you for sticking to the end. Do like the video and share your thoughts in the comment section below. Share this video with others and hit the bell icon to never miss a video from us. For more information on the software, click on the link given in the description box below. Adios and happy learning.